Can now put all of this in to here. glasses it's prescribed it's way different than the first pair that i got which was like these were more trendy it was more cute i broke them these are more sturdy and it's like it looks like i got them because i really can't see which is so funny because i could be wearing the most cool outfit and then i throw on these grandma glasses and low-key for me it ties it all together but for someone else it's like ugh, like she really can't see and that's the point i cannot I went too long without fixing these. My driving was terrible, parking even worse. Like, it's so embarrassing, but now I'm okay. Today, oh, it's spring by the way, so I wanna give a shout out to spring for not pulling through in Montreal, but we don't care, we got the spring stuff. I wanna highlight this scent from Bath & Body Works called Vanilla Cloud. It smells like marshmallow without the fire it smells like a vanilla cloud but it's not so vanilla-y like that makes you think of food it's the reason why i'm putting this on camera and the reason why i'm talking about this on camera is because i want to remember this for when i have kids so i know what i want their rooms to smell like because this is perfect mommy I'll do a little intro to the video with a voiceover so yeah this is me in the gym I will say that I was really sore and I was kind of like I already started having a cold but it was getting worse on this day specifically so everything felt weird everything was annoying um, I was sore for no reason even in places that I didn't work out and I decided to do full body instead of just doing legs and yeah, so I did legs, upper, I did core, and I did sprints, but I didn't film, like, literally, I would say 60% of the workout because I went at night thinking I could do it, and I got tired, like, after the first 15, and so I realized that because I was filming, my time at the gym was going to be extended, so I was like, okay, I'm just going to film a couple of stuff, and then the rest, I will definitely do it off camera just to speed up the process. But yeah, um, so far the video is starting off really calm on purpose, but it's going to pick up. It's going to be a little bit more exciting uh, the more and more, 
you know, like, I'm just getting it warmed up. And then, um, yeah, like, I really don't have much to say. It's spring. Um, what else? Anything you want to say to them? I just wanted to say hi. <laughs> <laughs> just just talk like be normal this is me doing pull-ups by the way i want to get um i want to actually do pull-ups like i keep trying and failing and trying and failing and like picking it up and not fulfilling it like no for real for real like by summer i need to be able to do at least 10 okay chill at least five so i've been practicing pull-ups every workout even the days that i do legs i have been practicing my pull-ups sorry to cut you off but i'm just gonna continue so yeah oh the workout is over and that's pretty much all it was i'm back from the gym it is currently currently 10 46. oh it's 11 46. So, um, the fatigue has a hit. I took a really fat nap, which is why I had energy to go to the gym at, at night. But, um, the fact of the matter is I'm not tired, right? So, oh, speaking of, I got, I got these two from Lemmy, um, Lemmy Company. The Lemmy Sleep. It does work. The Lemmy Chill. I don't know if it works. I can't tell. Um, but I have a pounding headache. I've been sick. I've been short of breath, headache, sore muscles, like everything. Oh, am I going to get demonetized for taking um, ibuprofen on camera? Let's keep it in and see how it goes. If they like do something, then I won't do it next time. I'm going to take two of these. Just um, So... I want to watch a movie, but I don't know what movie to watch. I'm going to go on Letterbox. I want to watch a film. I don't want to watch a movie. I want to watch a film. It's Good Friday. I'm here. I don't want to do rom-com just because I'm not really in the mood. Dune Part 2 I can't watch because I promised my sister I'd watch it with her. I guess I'll edit. Because I can't. There's only so many emergency intercom podcast episodes i could watch straight without losing my mind american fiction was really really good it's a great um quick watch it wasn't really it was cool it, was, it wasn't long it was really good i want to watch anyone but you but i want to watch it with someone i don't want to watch it alone so that's out i loved priscilla i don't want to rewatch it though because uh, i don't want to get sad they're so cute can you imagine me with just, I'll literally get it like, first investment is my little dog. Fun fact about Pulp Fiction, I watched it for the first time sometime last year and the one of the guys in the in the movie, his name's Marcellus, and I want a sausage dog or a Dutchin, I don't know if that's how you say it, but that's the dog I want. And I already planned on calling it Marcellus. Um, so like if you steal that name like you're just so unoriginal and boring and um i feel bad for you that was so mean out of character out of character it's been a long day but you know like don't steal the name but also the inspo for me getting my glasses was pretty much this picture just letting you know um, i wanted it to be red for some reason like this type of red but then i didn't want thin thin ones because I felt like if it was too thin, my lashes would pop up on top, which is funny because I'm not going to be doing lashes anymore, I'm going to be doing classics, so that whole thing is just out the window, the logic of it all. But we're not going to do anything tonight. TikTok with a girl that brought her iPad to the concert, and I was like, literally me, but the only thing is I know if I ever did that, like, Montreal people don't play, they would smash it to the ground. <laughs> I wish my thumbnail could just be this, nothing else.
I will rarely wear my hair out alone, especially because even when it's straight, it is lacking in volume and in length. So I decided to do clip-ins. So this is the hair, like it's not that different in texture, but as you can see, the color is a lot different. So. I decided to install it anyway and it did a really cool balayage effect. It didn't, like it blended super well, so. Okay. I was trying to think about what curls I wanted to do. I decided on doing sort of like the one you see on the screen here. Uh, what do you guys think about the highlights the honey blonde certain hairstyles could really exude different types of vibes is what i'm trying to say like yeah i'm really tired of realizing that i don't do outros never think of it and then i'm editing and it's like oh give them closure i like to do it but i just feel like sometimes i wish i had like some sort of bit i don't know like a cool outro a cool like fade out sequence mm, I don't know like a montage really I don't know just something something to just something to like I don't think I have one though I don't have one I don't have one so look at what my mug says when I was younger my mom used to make my sister and I drink milk before bed because it would make us real sleepy. <laughs> I got older and I still like I still have a glass of milk before bed and I don't think it's ever really gonna change. I feel like it's a little bit like because uh, some people, a lot of people have been saying, oh, milk straight up is just nasty and like <sighs> I don't know what it is. I don't. I can't even air this because all the vegans are gonna come for me. Like. Why is it not oat milk? Why is it not almond milk? I don't know. That's just not what I was used to. Y'all want me to drink almond milk so bad. And it's like, I'm going to one day. It's not what I'm used to. Do you see that little, uh, the flashlight thing? The, the little lightning thing and then the number 82. Lactin 82 days consistent with the word. I'm, not, I'm proud, so I wanted to show you. And if you feel some type of way about it, which you shouldn't, just tap in. Like it really just hit me. I get to hear this live, and some of you guys might be like, "Oh, he's not even like an artist like that." Like, shut up. Some people aren't like you. Some people like liked him as their favorite artist. Seg one, seg two. It was every time, Bryson. Every time. Ask anyone who knows me. So I'm gonna talk about this as much as I want to. If I didn't get the concert tickets, I wouldn't have died or nothing. But this isn't the first time Bryson is in Montreal and stuff. I'm just like, I am I just feel like it's kind of cool finally being able to just buy a ticket to go to a concert. I wasn't able to do that when I was much younger, especially when I was in sec two or what you guys would call it like middle school. My mom was not letting me go to no concert. So like, no, I wasn't, she didn't even know I listened to Bryson Tiller. So it's like, no, no concert for you. Fight. Today was Easter. I just wanted to say Happy Easter, everyone. 
and yeah he is risen today was good i went to i went to service for easter yeah oh the nails you guys haven't seen them okay got my extensions i did like wolf e layers I don't know if they're considered wolf. Without the glasses, I become super mature, Range Rover, all that. I want to put the glasses on. Like a new fave on point collection from Isabel Mathers. Is that how you say your name? Isabel Mathers. Uh, it's from this brand that I found like I think a year and a half ago called Crop Shop Beauty. Crop Shop Boutique. I couldn't find it elsewhere. Usually I'll reverse Google image search and see if I could find something similar elsewhere because it's from Australia so I had to pay duties and taxes. So that wasn't fun. But look at the back. So cute! Shout out Isabel Mathers, your collection, 8 down. Also this week, I've been really sick. Like, not even cute. I to Switzerland, I left my Jesus piece over there, so I have no no like everyday necklace because that was like the one thing I wouldn't take off. But I was like, okay, like it was for what's it called? It was for an event, so it was for Christmas, and I had another necklace to put on. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna. I never brought it back, so that's that. This hair is eating downtown. Also, I want to start posting myself on my Pinterest because I was thinking, you know how like Pinterest, you could like post your own stuff. I'm like, okay, why not? Because who knows if I delete or deactivate my Instagram once more. Like who knows at this point, the way life bothers me sometimes. I'm just like detach. So if ever I do it, but I still have like bangers that I want to post, I guess I'll put them on Pinterest. If you're with me on that i'm not sure okay we're about to bake but with banana bread i just want to say one thing um you will never get the same recipe twice <sighs> the fruit itself the banana it comes in different sizes so it's like if you use the mini ones it's a little bit more cakey if you use the huge ones then you know what i mean and then also it depends on how ripe the banana is as well so you're never gonna get the same taste twice but thankfully that means that i don't have to like quote unquote perfect it the thing i want to change is not putting any baking powder and putting a little bit less flour just so that i could have more and, uh, and honey and honey and that. part of me really wishes that i had like longer nails with this french tip like long like, like the me from back in the day oh she would have had a blast on youtube Let's make Mara the scientist shirts so that I can wear it to a concert. segment because i know i need something to introduce it and we're just about to go to a mariah the scientist concert i'm definitely gonna film a Goretti with me though come on rockstar need was not really happy this morning but look at us now we got the separate room we got these two look like bigger hoops
she's on Toronto and you just came over here? Am I hurting anybody's feelings? I hope not. I just wanted to do my spring phase really quick. Starting with my fragrance for spring is gonna definitely be Dolce and Gabbana, the one gold intense version, but they also have another version. I'm gonna try and get as many of these as I can without being like a hoarder or being irresponsible just because I know it's gonna be out of stock or whatever they say. What's it called? Discontinued. Sadly, sadly. Next, we got Occitane's um, Intensive Hand Balm. I love this. It actually, I just put it on, but I want to squeeze some out just to show you how thick it is. Right? At first I thought it was sticky, but it's not. It does what it says it's supposed to do. It's 25%, so it's really gonna do the trick. There's also a 20% one, I think. I also like the metal um, tube. I think it's cool. Next, we got an air tag, the Apple air tag. I put it in my wallet, but my wallet has this little flicky, so I'm gonna definitely hang it out because I know it's not safe to put it in the slot. It's too thick for that. Next, we got the Rode lip balm the uh, watermelon one i only reach for this one like every morning it's not too thick it's not too thin i've been just really obsessed with it i don't know why next we have vanilla cloud the scent now i will say the fragrance in the candle just doesn't do what it does in the wallflower i'm about to go get five right now because it's been like running like people have been getting it a lot more which i don't understand why like stop like just stop but yeah like i'm actually i don't know why every time i enter my closet because the wallflowers in my closet and i smell it doesn't smell like vanilla it smells like something like like a like a cloud it smells like a cloud every time i go in my closet and i smell it i'm like bro i gotta go and get more and i get so annoyed by like how how much it's been bothering me that I have to continue like every morning I wake up and I st I think about how it might get sold out on me so I'm going today right now I'm dressed I'm dressed I'm gonna go lastly we have my new glasses again and that's the end of my April faves also the end of the video thank you so much for watching I'll see you in the next one. I really wanted to be consistent. Last week I was supposed to drop a hair video, but the brand had another hair thing that they wanted me to do instead. So they kind of like made me halt it, but they didn't understand. Like, I don't really care. I don't want to do hair anymore. So anyways, that's a, that's a whole, I could get into it. Long story cut, mega short. That's the reason why I didn't drop last week. And I'm really upset at myself because I feel like how is future you supposed to really be like in the loop if you're not updating, you know, if you're not updating, you gotta update not only the people watching, but also like for the future you who wants to watch this back and relive her youth, you're not updating her enough. I was really upset about that. But like I said, I'm trying to be consistent, especially with school, it's not the easiest. I really do enjoy these dumps the most. I, when summer comes and I start doing travel content, that's when you're going to see me pull out the big gun edits. But for now, kept it simple, kept it cute, kept it like super choppy, which I know some people hate, so I'm not the person for you if you don't like that. But yeah, like I kept it super quick pace, super like... Also, the Mariah the Scientist concert was absolutely amazing. She looks so 
good that woman is a beautiful vibe her stage presence she was talking she was telling us tea like i love her her vocals were on 10 the songs she picked her set list was on 10 her opener was a 10 her dj like the dj that she's touring with is a 10 everything her outfits are a 10 a lot of people had red theme or a hint of red in their outfits as well which is really cute to see montreal has the most beautiful people i've ever seen in my life at least at that concert i was just like whoa the boys pulled through it was kind of funny hearing a guy say what does she have on me you know what i mean some of them were just like trying to harden it up i'm like you gonna you don't want to be soft like Boys don't want to be soft sometimes, which is so funny because we were at a whole Mariah the Scientist concert. I saw girls that dragged in their boyfriends. It was so fun to see. Sisters that dragged in their brothers and boys that came as a group of boys as well. Section hopped as you've seen in the video because there's two different like point of views. I was at the top at first with my friend and then I was like, I need to get a closer look at Mariah. So I went down, I went down to the other floor and I saw another girl that I was, that's my mutual on Instagram over there. And so we chopped it up and then I ended up getting real close and I ended up seeing Mariah and we locked eyes. So yeah, another fave is these Zara jeans. Thank you for watching. Thank you.